Super Mario 3D All-Stars came out on Friday, and I, like many others, have been playing it non-stop. Though I could have told you a ton about them, by virtue of being a huge Nintendo fanboy, this is my first time playing all three of these games. When this collection got announced, the one I was the most excited to try was Super Mario Sunshine, and so far, it's the one I'm having the most fun with. Anyway, while I was playing, I came upon the infamous Pachinko level. It was tough, but after six attempts, I managed to grab the shine. In playing the level multiple times, I noticed some patterns in how the Machinko machine worked. So after I got the shine, I did some more testing, and I now believe I've come up with a strategy that makes what I've seen many call one of the hardest challenges in the game into one of the easiest. While many believe the level requires a ton of luck, this isn't actually true. The machine acts much more consistently than what many players are led to believe. If you walk into the launcher, let go of the stick, and then press B, you will be launched to the center pocket. Usually onto this pin here, but also sometimes straight into the pocket, and occasionally this pin up here, in which case you just take one step to the right. If you walk into the launcher and press B, and then immediately start pushing the sticks to the right until you land in a pocket, you will land in the top center pocket every time. On the other hand, if you step into the launcher and jump, and then immediately start pushing the stick left until you land in a pocket, you will land in the top left pocket. To get to the top right pocket, launch without touching the stick, but at the peak of the launch, start hovering to the right until you are over the top right pocket, then drop into it. To get to the bottom right pocket, hover over the lip of the back ramp and run up the slope. Then use the hover nozzle again to get into the pocket from behind. As long as you don't stop moving and don't turn around, you won't slide down the hill. So don't be an Orpheus and you'll be fine. Lastly, to get to the bottom left pocket, first launch to the center where you'll likely land on a peg above the pocket. Then jump up and hover to the left until you are over the pocket and then drop down. Now that you have all the red coins, simply launch to the center one last time and collect the shine. Well, that's the end of the video. I hope it helps you beat this tricky level. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to leave a like. And if you have any questions about the strategy, feel free to ask in the comments below. Bye.